Describe Father Dallin for us. Well, he's a lot like Tom Bosley. What way? He's calm, quiet, and uh, cares about what happens to people. And uh, there never was uh, violence on any of those shows. Yes, people were murdered, but we didn't see them get murdered. And uh, when they talked about doing this show, uh, they talked about having a, a, a more mature and straight-laced uh, nun to work with them. And I said, you know, it's much more interesting if you get somebody who's been in a lot of trouble and gotten rid of that and has gone uh, to become a nun, and you got a young girl. And of course, that worked out. That was really the kicker for us. And then later on, we brought it, they brought in this wonderful actor, James Stevens, and of course, uh, dear Mary Wicks, who played the housekeeper. When uh, we were casting it, they'd sit around there and they'd say, what you really want to hear is somebody like Mary Wicks. And I said, get Mary Wicks. And she came in, there and she had bad eyes as far as reading, and she had the sides, the print was like this. And, uh, and to one look at it, they said, no, 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 you don't have to read that, you got the part. And she was wonderful. She was our, our leader, really, on that show. She made sure that the, that the sound stages were warm, and that the locations, that the, when it was hot, that the, the uh, uh, you know, the trailers had uh, air conditioning in it. She was wonderful. And I really enjoyed that show. I think I enjoyed that show more than anything I've ever done because, uh, well, it was my show. I mean, I didn't create it. You know, I didn't have a piece of it or anything, but it was my show as far as uh, the role. And, uh, you know, it was something that I think that I felt I deserved at that time to have my own show. Why do you think the show was a success? I mean. What, what elements do you think people were drawn to? I think they were drawn to the fact that uh, we showed different aspects of, uh, even though mystery and murder and crime was the main thing, but we showed different aspects and different relationships uh, between the church and, 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 and the layman. You know. It was just... Uh, something that we regarded very highly. We did a, a show that uh, I never thought that the networks would allow, and that was John Rubenstein comes into my confessional, and it turns out he's my son from a relationship that I had prior to going into the priesthood, which is perfectly fine. You know. And then he's, he's up for murder, so I have to try and get him clear. Well, that was two things. That was a priest finding a son and, and uh, defending him out for murder and, and trying to find, establish a relationship, which the two of them in the end know will never happen. His mother is no, is no longer alive, and I inquire. You know, I tell him that I loved her very much. Uh, why, why did the show go off the air? Well, there are all kinds of stories. We were told that we were coming we're coming back for at least another year. And there was a show with James Earl Jones that they had tried the year before, uh, where he becomes a social worker after he gets out of prison. He's been in prison. And it was a good show, but nobody, nobody watched it. So they were trying to revamp it, and by revamping it, they wanted Richard Crenna to join the cast. Now, I was down in the desert, and I got a call from the guy from Viacom, and he says, looks like we're in. This was on a Saturday, and they're announcing it on Monday morning. And he calls me with tears in his eyes on Monday. What happened was the network gave Richard Crenna's agent till midnight on Sunday to make the deal. 
And if they didn't make the deal, the show wasn't the Earl, James Earl Jones show was not going to go on the air. And they made the deal, and we were the show they dropped. And the James Earl Jones show, I think, got on for two episodes and was canceled. So you win some and you lose some. That must have been hard, though. It was, I because they had blown excuse me had blown us up to the fact that we were going to be. Uh, be on the air.